Good evening, teacher. Hello, how are you? Good evening. I'm fine, teacher, and you? Okay, thank you. Good I'm evening, fine. Teacher. Good evening, teacher. Hello, how are you? Good evening. Glad to see you again. So sorry. I am in the hospital. Oh, really? Yes. I do really sorry to hear that. Thank you, teacher. Por eso creo que me voy a conectar, pero creo que solo un rato para para no. Okay. Y es usted la que está eh, con problemas de salud o es un algún familiar? Mi hermano. Ah, okay, su hermano. Mi, mi hermano y, y estamos aquí. Okay. Okie dokie. Good evening. Hello, sir. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. How are you? Nice, and you? I'm fine, teacher. Waiting. It is a pleasure to see you again, sir. Yes, thank you. Waiting the class, uh, the, the last day, the week, okay? Okay. After, after the class, I go to the parish, teacher. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. okay, you are going to celebrate. Yes, to my wife, okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yes. No problem. If, and you, and you? If you are going to go with your wife, no problem, okay? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes, yes.
It's going to be only with your wife, okay? <laughs> okay, teacher, thank you. <laughs> nice. I like that, to hear that, you know? Go to the party, but be careful. Be careful with the COVID. You need to use your mask. Okay, let me see, only 12. Okay, I'm waiting, I'm waiting for the rest of the class. Estoy en espera de los demás compañeros. Es posible que más de algunos horados estoy trabajando. Okay. Sí, ok, no sé qué pasó, hubo un bajón de, de señal quizá y perdí la conexión en un momentito, pero ya estoy aquí otra vez. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Hello. How are you? Fine. No Bye. sé si ya pasó listado. No, ahorita hemos estado esperando. Okay, thank you. Good evening, teacher. Hello, how are you, sir? Uh, teacher, solamente voy a estar como oyente. Voy manejando, estoy saliendo de Santa Rosa de Lima. Oh, be eh, careful, sir, be careful. No voy a poder participar. Okay. Me too, teacher. 
No. <laughs> no. Welcome, Elizabeth. Ah, eso, eso, ahí está. Thank ahí. you, Don Luis. Thank you. Ahí está, don, ahí está don, don Luisito ya dando la bienvenida. Welcome. I meet, okay. Don Luis, welcome to the class. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, let us do now, please. Esperemos que no tengamos otro problema de, de, de señal. Por cualquier cosa voy a tener lista mi otra máquina. No sabemos lo que pueda suceder. We never know what can happen. Okay, today is Friday. Ana Beatriz, are you there? Presentation. Welcome. Uh, Blanca? Presentation. Carlos Alfredo? Um, Carlos Alfredo? I don't know, he's the one that is driving. Uh, Carlos Antonio. Present. Okay. No te que se Cristian Ernesto. Present teacher. Claudio. Present. Eh, Grisao. Present teacher. Edwin Balmore. No apareció ya, no apareció. Eh, Elmer. Está Elmer, ya no está Elmer. Ember. No, no tienen código. Ember. Okay. Elizabeth. Present no, vamos a tener que... Eh, Gonzalo. Quiero ver cómo se receta ya. Gonzalo. Gonzalo no está. Le he dicho que... Eh, Luis Alfonso. Present teacher. Luis Manuel. Luis Manuel. No se encuentra María Elena. Present. I'm here, teacher. Eh, Nelson. I'm here. Eh, Omar. Present teacher. Welcome, sir. Oscar. Present teacher. Walter. Present teacher. Eh, Jenny. Jenny. Present teacher. Ok, le oigo muy bajo el volumen. Eh, Ana Judith. Ya no apareció. A Carlos Javier Crespín. Present teacher. Ok. Eh, José Eduardo. Present teacher. Eh, Juan Carlos. Present teacher. And Carla Marisol. Carla Marisol. Carla Marisol. No está. Bueno. Ok. Welcome back to all of you. We are going to start working and... Okay, uh, do you remember we were talking about different, uh, we have been talking about different topics, but yesterday, uh, specific, we were talking about how to use B plus going to, okay? And also you were uh, sharing some uh, sentences, and we are going to continue doing uh, today. And the question for you is going to be, what are you going to do tomorrow? I need an answer. Raise your hand if you want to answer the question, please.
No veo las manitos ahí. I don't see your hands up. Okay, tell me about your plans for tomorrow or maybe for uh, tonight after the class. Luis Alfonso already uh, told me something that he is going to visit a disco. I don't know where. I'm going to, I going to uh, go to the party for my wife, okay? This okay, night. okay, after, nice. After, after the class. After the class, because today is Friday and Ustedes saben lo demás. Tomorrow, tomorrow, teacher, I, I, tomorrow, I'm going to, 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 to my, to my shirt, okay? It's Alco City. Ah, it's Alco City. Yes, sir. Okay, okay, okay. Excellent. Okay, what about the rest? Share with me your plan for tomorrow, please. Tell me. By using going to, please. Maria Elena Guadalupe Peñate. Ah, good evening. Hello, I good evening. Am staying home. I am going to play a video, maybe. Okay. Tan pronto. Eh... Alguien termine de participar, puede seguir el otro para no estar esperando. Paso más, son variados. Finish, you can start doing this activity, please. Teacher, tomorrow, tomorrow I, I am going to play soccer at 2 p.m. Ah, ok, nice. Excellent. Son variados, please, hurry up. For me, Hello. for me, I am going to the watch the fin final, the cup gold, the Copa that's, de Oro. That's the, the, okay, the gold cup, talking about soccer match. Yes. Okay. You are going to watch the soccer match, okay. Grisel? In my case. <laughs> Go ahead, continue. Grisel, continue, please. I'm sorry, teacher. Uh, I'm going to. Wait. Tomorrow I'm going to work in the afternoon, but in the morning I'm going to start in the house. You're going to stay in your home, okay? Ana Beatriz. My, okay, teacher. Tomorrow, uh, tomorrow I go shopping at the market. Okay, could you repeat your sentence, please? Tomorrow I go to uh shopping in the market okay something is missing in your sentence hay algo que nos falta en la oración revísela revísela and try to remember the structure that we started yesterday okay para mientras siga carlos javier thank you teacher it's, uh... My brothers, in, are they going to movies tomorrow? Repeat again, please. Your brother. My brothers, are they going to the movies tomorrow? Mm. Después del tú nos hace falta algo. Um, what, sir? Falta el verbo. 
my brothers are going to, and then? Um, sorry, teacher. Falta el verbo, solo el verbo a su parte. Here go, teacher, no. Yeah. My brother are going to... ¿Sí? ¿Es inglés? Ah, are going to watch a movie. Ok. Ana Beatriz encont encontró... ¿Dónde? Teacher y shopping. Ah, como verbo. Ok, recordemos la estructura. Si vamos a usar going to, el verbo, ah, va a ir... ya. <ríe> el verbo va a ir en su forma base. I'm going to shopping sería a uh, the market oh. tomorrow. I, I go to tomorrow going shopping to... a mark, at the market. Shop only. Shop only. Shop only. Okay, somebody else, please. Let me see. Walter, Jenny. Um, the star panel. The star. You a star. Go ahead, Jenny. Me. Okay. Uh, tomorrow in the morning, I'm going to work. In the afternoon, I'm going to clean the car, and after I'm going to visit my grandmother. Ah, nice. Three different activities. Yes. Sí, pero, pero los demás, la mayoría son bien stingy, ¿verdad? Bien tacaño, solo me dan una oración. Okay, continue, please. Somebody else. Um, I am going to run six... I am tomorrow. I made uh, like jogging. Make jogging. Yes. Yes. Oh. Next, next, next. I am going to uh, work in the company. Ah, okay. Okay. In order to be energetic. Okay. Yes. First room. Next work. Ah, okay. Okay. Excellent. Yes. Okay. Somebody else. Somebody else. Please. Somebody else. Hurry up. Hurry up. We don't have. A lot of time. Proximo, por favor. Me teacher. Okay, Omar Francisco, come in. Tomorrow I'm going to meeting online in the morning. Mm. Okay, check up your sentence there. Follow the structure. Chequemos la, la, la estructura, porque después de el to, el verbo va en su forma base. Tomorrow I am going to. ¿Sí? ¿Cuál sería el verbo? Meet. Could be, but also you can say tomorrow I am going to have a, to have a meeting in my company. Ok. ¿Me comprendió? Dice, sí, voy a repetir porque yo tuve problemas con la conexión y no sé en qué están ahorita. Ahorita lo que estamos haciendo es que you are going to tell me your plans for tomorrow. What you are going to do tomorrow. It could be morning, noon, afternoon, night. ¿Cuáles son sus planes para mañana? I'm going. Ah, ok. Ok. Thank you. Tell me. Sería. Eh, uh, I'm going to go to the world morning. Eh, in the afternoon at my house. But I need the whole sentence. Yeah. 
Ya, oración. Ya, ya. Could you repeat the third one, please? Repita la primera, por favor. Are going to... Are going to... I am going to... I am going to go to work in the morning in the afternoon in my house. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I, I need to... Somebody is telling me something. Let me see who is it. Ana Beatriz, I guess. Okay. Uh, you, yes. You want to say something? Uh, Seria, so I'm going to help shopping at the market tomorrow and the visit uh, my grandmother. Okay, but, but I, uh, it's going to be better if you split, no? split it. Si split, la separa no? será mejor. Por ejemplo, viene usted y dice, I am going to visit y luego le pone el complemento porque lo que quiero es que se repita la expresión para que se quede grabada ¿sí? Okay. Nelson parece que quiere decir algo Nelson Hello, eh, sí eh, tomorrow I going to I going to the visit family ah ok tomorrow you are going to visit your family ok yes. You visit oh. family. Visit. You, you can say okay. visit my family. Uh, also, you can say visit my wife family. All depend. Depend. Oh, uh, sí, depend. Your father. Okay. father. Your father. Okay, let us continue. I'm going to share something with you. Let me see here. Ok, necesito que esas estructuras que ya vimos les vayan quedando bastante claritas para que no tengamos uh, ninguna duda. Y al momento que nos toque usar la estructura, eh, lo hagamos de la mejor manera. Ya sabemos que después del going to, lo que va es el verbo en su forma base. ¿Sí? Okay, I got some example here. What are your plans for tomorrow? Somebody could say, okay, tomorrow I am going to. If I ask you, are you going to work? What is the answer for that question? Are you going to work tomorrow? Yes, I am going to work tomorrow. Okay, okay. Are you going to take the day off tomorrow? Do you, do you know? Do you know what is the meaning of to take the day off? I'm not going to take the day off. Okay. Okay. Where are you going at noon? Where are you going at noon? A donde irá al mediodía? Maybe you have plans to go to a restaurant or something like that. I don't know. I'm going to. I'm going to. Volcan. You are you are going to see the volcano in Isauco. Volcano. Oh, okay, let us do the exercise number two. Okay, right here we are going to write down three features or three product. Okay, when we talk about product, that means that you are going to write down three names. Van a escribir tres nombres. Eh, en este caso, por ejemplo, podría ser eh, el ejemplo que dio el, eh, Don Luis, que podría ser una loción. Aquí podemos tener, en este caso, eh, el peso, podría ser el size y podría ser el precio. Son algunas ideas. Ustedes van a hacer un cuadrito como este y eh, van a escribir tres productos y luego van a poner tres categorías de esos productos. ¿Se comprende? ¿Se recuerdan del tema que vimos al inicio? ¿Sí? Ahí, lo tienen, ahí lo tienen también en sus libros. Ahí aparecen. Ustedes van a tomar las características que ustedes consideren. Esas son las features. 
For example, if, uh, if I can write here, I say a car. So yo pongo aquí un carro, como lo quiero el carro. Well, it could be four doors, two doors, uh, the brand could be Toyota, could be Nissan, could be Honda. And right here I can write down the price. En la final puedo escribir el precio o even the year that I want to buy the car. El año en el que yo quiero el carro, ¿sí? In my case, I prefer, I prefer the old ones. Yo prefiero los carros viejitos. Los modernos why, son... Teacher, why? Because uh, they are not complicated. Y todos los repuestos son más baratos. In my case, in, a, my, in the particular case, I prefer a uh, Toyota Corolla, you know, because I need to move to different places and, uh, and I need to have an economic car. Un carrito de trabajo, pues, sencillo, humble. What is year? Ah, uh, could be 2008, 2010. Yeah. It is not all. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it is all because right now we are in uh, 2021. <laughs> all car is 2000, 2005. <laughs> 99, 98, 97. 99, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, all depend. Yes, depend the money. Yeah. Now the problem is that the new one have a lot of sensor, you know. For everything, if you uh, need, uh, if you got a flat tire, you got a, a, a sensor, uh, you got a pilot in, in your, yeah. And everything you need to pay for that in order to put the computer in the scan and everything in order to set it again. And it's really difficult. Los carros modernos tienen muchos sensores, se encienden muchos pilotos y cada vez de programarlos hay que pagar por lo menos 35 dólares. Se fue el día de trabajo ahí. Entonces hay que buscar la economía. In my case, I don't know. Una vida 35 dólares. Hola. Yo quiero un trabajo de esos. ¿De cuáles? De eso, no gana, de eso no que gana 35 dólares diarios. Hey, you, you get more than that, sir. <laughs> the problem here is that uh, we don't get the money according to the hours that we work. Maybe in some places. O en algunas de sus compañías le pagan por, por el valor de hora, ¿no? ¿Verdad? ¿No? No, teacher, only day. Oh, the, okay, the whole day. Okay. In my case, this is a part-time job. Do you know? Do you know what is a part-time job, right? And I work for hours. Also, in university, I work for hours. Okay, ¿quién lo terminó? ¿Quién lo terminó? ¿Quién ya lo tiene, por favor? Just tell me. Okay, please, And if you want, you can share your screen and you can explain us. 
cuando ya lo terminen, si lo hicieron en, eh, por ejemplo, si no lo hicieron así by hand, if you have any new computer, if you want to share it, you can share the screen. Me teacher. Walter. Uh, for example, um, product card on the Civic right 5,000. Okay. Eh, un phone. Uh, un, oh, a, a, eleven. Eh, black. Eh, one hunter. Eh, TV. Sunny. Black. Uh, Two hundred. Okay. What about the price? <laughs> Recuerden que debemos de mantener las mismas características si, por ejemplo, al artículo le van a poner el precio, el peso, o si, como ya dije, si es carro, le van a poner eh, la marca, el modelo, y eso se va a, se va a evidenciar para, el, para los demás artículos. Ok, Oscar Arnulfo, go ahead, if you want to share the info with us, please. Ok, my future is marca, color, and price. Product, color, mark, citizen, color, black, Price $100. The second product, pants, Mark Levi's, color blue, price $40. And three product, shoes, Mark Nike, color black and white, price $60. Okay. Blanca Elizabeth. Eh, ¿Cómo se dice? Future products, o sea, size, color, price. Okay. Dress, dress, small, black, twenty, twenty, twenty five. Shoes, seven, beige, in color, the price is forty. Pants. Five, white, and sixteen. Okay. Hello. Um, about the products, uh, mark, kind of price. Okay. Uh, the motorcycle, Mark Suzuki, kind of deportive. And price three hundred dollar. Body lotion is other product. Mark Nivea, kind of exfoliant. And price fifteen dollar. And about clothes, anything mark, kind of casual, and ten dollars. Okay, I hear something. Let me see in the in the fair product. Could you repeat about the motorcycle, please? Mark Suzuki. Okay. Uh, how do you say deportiva? Sport. Sport. Sport, ah, okay. Kind of sport <laughs> and price three hundred dollars. Ah, okay, okay. Sorry. Okay, sí, porque si se lo dejo así después para decir, ah, pues sí estaba bien. <laughs> okay, let me see, María okay, Elena. Thank you. Well, María Elena. Ah, excuse me. Um, 
three articles. Uh, the first, a um, motorcycle on the shadow 150. Year 20. Ah, no sé. Veinte veintiséis para dos mil veintiséis, ¿verdad? Twenty sixteen. Twenty sixteen. Twenty sixteen. Ah, maximum maximum speed one hundred kilometers per hour. Per hour. Okay. Ah, second. Toyota Corolla, year 2018, maximum speed, uh, 150 km per hour, per hour, and price, $1,800, and the third, uh, bicycle, year 2021, maximum speed, 15 kilometers per, per hour, price $100. Okay, Carlos, Javier. Thank you, teacher. Uh, factors product, shirt, and price uh, $20. Brand, Pierre Ricardin, color, blue. Second, bike. And twenty hundred dollars brand Lala color black three soccer ball and price and thirty dollar brand Mikasa color light blue white uh, white white okay see let me see Jenny. One question, teacher. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice gigabyte? Gigabyte is, is, is an English word. Gigabyte. Okay. Gigabyte. Um, products is cell phone, dimension six inch, memory 128 gigabyte, battery life um, 24 hours, price uh, 200. Okay. Uh, second smartwatch dimension one inch memory one gigabyte battery life um, fifteen days price no, no, price uh, sixty dollars in computer <coughs> dimension fourteen inch memory uh, no, me two hundred. 56 gigabytes, battery life, uh, 24 hours, price 500. 500, okay. Thank you. Maria, please. Ana Beatriz. Okay, teacher. Tablet Samsung, wage, uh, then points one inch, dimension, each gigabyte ROM, and uh, two fifteen six gigabyte ROM. Price at uh, one hundred fifteen. And lotion Perrielli, uh, wage, uh, twelving ounces. Dimension is one hundred. No. Ay, teacher, ¿cómo se dice ciento veinte? One hundred twenty. Ah, sí. Ah, okay. One hundred twenty. El Emil. Price. Eh, milligram. Milligram. El ML. Yeah, el milligram. En milligram. All right. Eh, price eh, forty five. The price, okay. price is 45, 45 dollars. 45. Okay, 45, 45 dollars. It's cheap, it's okay. cheap now. TV Samsung weighs, eh, 13, se me olvidó, 13, 13 teacher, se me olvidó, sorry. 13. 13.4 kilograms, 
uh, dimension uh, 63.1 cent price $275. Okay, thank you. Let us continue, please. Thank you very much. Okay, in order to continue, we are going to do something else. Okay, I don't know if you are able to see. Oh, let me see what happened here. Jesus. Okay, I don't know if you are able to see what I have in my screen. Can you read exactly what I have there? I'm going to move a little bit. Hold on a second. Creo que hay un problemilla ahí con una palabra que no se puede ver muy bien. I'm going to move it a little bit. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, here we go again. Okay, what you are watching is are some skills. I don't know if you can see it very well now. Yes, yes teacher. Yes. yes or not? Hello? Yes, yes, I can see. Okay. Okay. What can you tell me about it? Are you familiar with those names? Like assertiveness, self-confidence, open-mindedness, proactive, honesty, good judgment, communication, teamwork, empathy, ability to delegate, active listening, understanding boundaries, leadership skill, good manner, ability to read body language, conflict resolution, persuasion, negotiation, problem solving, Okay, what we are going to do is this. We are going to use, uh, if you want, you are going to use one word from my list, but if you don't want, you are going to use another word that you know, okay? En español, uh, cuando se genere la pregunta, usted puede usar cualquiera de las características que están en la lista que tengo ahí, pero si no, Eh, usted puede usar cualquier otra palabra que usted eh, tenga en su, en su background knowledge, ¿ok? Ok, uh, let, me, let me see this. Let me I ask have you. a question. Ok, ¿qué es tu pregunta? I don't know what do you, ¿qué quiere decir? Uh, understanding boundary. I don't know what is it. Eleven. Uh, I I didn't I I didn't get what you are trying to tell me. Do you do you need the meaning of uh, something or or do you need a whole explanation? No sé si lo que necesita es eh, una explicación de lo que acabo de decir o o, al, o alguna frase en especial. No sé. La número 11, no sé qué. Understanding boundaries. I don't understand. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Don't worry, I'm going to tell you the minute. First of all, we need to take, okay, excuse me, somebody say something. Yes, teacher. Eh, sorry, eh, pero no comprendí muy bien la indicación de lo que hay que hacer. No sé si me lo puede repetir, por favor. Okay, I'm going to tell you in Spanish. Tengo una lista de habilidades que algunas personas poseen, pero no todas, por ejemplo, poseen la habilidad de la empatía, del trabajo en equipo, de comunicación, eh, que sean proactivos y honestos. ¿Ya? Ok. En this case, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to ask you a question. Lo que voy a hacer es que uh, I'm going to ask you a question. Le voy a hacer una pregunta. And the question is this. Can you tell me one of your skills? Podría decirme cada uno de ustedes 
una de sus habilidades. Oh, ok, ok. I see. Gracias, teacher. Thank you. Ok, ok, ok. Si quieren, hacen una captura de, de toda la, la lista y si no, pueden usar cualquiera de las que ustedes consideren. ¿Ya está? ¿O todavía no? No necesariamente. Yes, you, are, you are going to use what I have. In, uh... A tomar la captura, iba a la quitó. No, no, ahí está, no le he quitado. Ah. No le he quitado. No, se me congeló la pantalla. Ah, ok. El 11, eh, el que habla de Understanding Boundaries, ese es como barrera de entendimiento para comprender alguna instrucción. Ok. Ok, let us talk about your skill. Imagine, imagine that you are in an interview and you're the person that is in share to make the interview ask you, okay, tell me about your skill. What can you tell? My skills teacher are empathy and teamwork. Okay. And now you are going to ask to somebody else. Uh, tan pronto participen, ustedes le van a hacer la misma pregunta a un compañero, pero ya en forma directa. How you are going to do it? Okay, you are going to say, okay, for example, you say, okay, my skills are this and that. And what about you, uh, Carlos Javier? Y Carlos va a comenzar a dar la respuesta y después le va a decir, Carlos, okay, what about you, Omar Francisco? Y así, van a ir poniendo atención de quienes ya van participando y vamos a ir buscando la gente que no ha participado. Okay, let us do it now, please. Okay, what about you, Ana Beatriz? What are your skills? Hello, repeat. Sorry. What about you? Oops. What, what are your skills? Skills. Oops. Esa palabra no la entendí. Sorry. ¿Cuáles son sus habilidades? All right. Okay. okay, antes de que continúen, si yo estoy, por ejemplo, hablando, if I'm talking about likes and dislikes, and I say, okay, I like vegetable and fruit, and I say, what about you? Si yo pregunto eso, estoy como repitiendo la misma pregunta, pero ya no con todas las palabras, sino, ¿y usted qué dice? ¿Qué piensa de la misma pregunta? Okay. All right, is I... I am empathic and communicate and oh. lealties. Communicative. Uh, lealties. Loyalty. Loyalty. Loyalties. All right. Um, uh, charismatic. ¿Cómo sería, teacher? Yeah, it's the same. Así, ah, charismatic. Uh, it is. <laughs> Muchas más, no sé cómo diría. Ok, ask the question to somebody else, please. Y... ¿Cómo sería María Elena? María Elena. I'm here. Y cómo sería, es la pregunta, ah, yeah. ¿verdad, chicos? Yes. Uh, tan what pronto, about you? Yeah, tan pronto usted termine, usted lo dice, what about you, Fulana de tal. All right. Uh, María Elena, what about you? Um, in my case, I go to say persuasion, persuasion and empathy. 
Um, what about you, Carlos Antonio? For me, you, lo, loyalty, honesty, and teamwork. What about you, Christian? Okay, um, my skill is um, positive attitude, communication, teamwork, and resilience. Ah, okay, 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 okay. If you are going to mention more than one, we are going to use my skill as my skill are. But if you are going to talk only just about one, you are going to say, my skill is, if you have only one. But if you are going to talk about two or more than two, you are going to use R, okay? Okay. Okay, somebody else, please. To whom? A quien la pregunta? Uh, Mr. Omar Francisco. What your skill? I think or be empathic, ability to delegate. Okay, to somebody else, but in a hurry, please, in a hurry, in a hurry. What about you, Jose Eduardo? Jose Eduardo, are you there, Jose Eduardo? Hello. <laughs> um, I am... <laughs> I'm sorry, I am self-confidence. Ah, okay, self-confidence. Uh, what about you? Um, Mr. Luis Alonso. What about you? Okay, in my case, my, in my case, my... My skill uh, are are some. Uh, one is is a uh, is a uh, conflict resolution and problem solving. Problem solving. What about you, Walter Villalta? Walter, I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> okay. Uh, my skills are uh, number one, uh, teamwork. Number two, ability to delegate. Uh, number three, honesty. Oh, honesty, this is a canción. Honesty. 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 Thank you. Honesty. honesty. Okay, thank you. Um, but I will do, uh, Juan Carlos, what are your skills? My skills are empathy and teamwork. Okay, okay excellent. What about you, Mr. Luis Alonso? Luis Antonio, maybe. Luis Alfonso. Alfonso creo que ya participó. I don't know. Bye. Bye. Oscar Anulfo. What about you? My skill are uh, passion, communication, and teamwork. Uh, what about you, Blanca? In my case, open, mean day. 
in this day in practically honesty good manner where about you come on where where about you Okay. Omar, Omar Francisco. Ok. Dicho, ya participé, pero igual puedo contestarlo. Eh, is um, Chincor Empathy Ability to Delegate. Okay. That's it. Okay. Uh, Mr. Claudio Mendes, what about you? Uh, my, my skill is proactive, honesty, uh, empathy, and friendly. Uh, what about you, Elizabeth? Yo lo voy a ver. Se me durmió, se me durmió. <laughs> ok, 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 ok. Let me see. I'm going to take a look at the attendance now. What about you? What about you? Sorry, teacher. What about you, Grisel? Hello, okay, in my case, my skills are proactive honesty, um, very empathy with the other person, and communicate skills. Okay, so please, uh, I'm going to ask for your name, please, Ana Beatriz. Present. Okay, thank you, uh, Blanca. Present, uh, Carlos Alfredo. Carlos Alfredo. Carlos Antonio. Present. Cristian Ernesto. Present, teacher. Claudio Iván. Present, teacher. Grisel. Present. Edwin. Valmore Flores. Elmer Ubaldo Ramírez Cruz. Ember Giovanni. Elizabeth Martínez. Gonzalo, Gonzalo, Luis Alfonso, Present teacher, Luis Manuel, Luis Manuel, María Elena. Present. Nelson. I'm here. Omar Francisco. Present teacher. Oscar Arnulfo. Present. Walter. Present teacher. Jenny. Present. Ana Judith. Carlos Javier, 
Okay, present Eduardo. teacher. Present teacher, present. Juan Carlos. Present. Carla Marisol. Carla Marisol. It's not here, okay. Okay, let teacher, us continue. I'm here. Teacher, I'm here. Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Yeah. Let me see. Let me see. Elizabeth Martinez, yeah. Yes. I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it. Okay, now uh, we are going to talk about another topic that we have started. Do you remember that we started and have to, uh, in order to obligation, do you remember that? Okay, I'm going to ask you a question. What do you have to do tomorrow, for example? Who wants to answer this question? Something that is an obligation for you to do it tomorrow. You have to eat the pusas. <laughs> okay, let us talk about your company. It's gonna be better because <laughs> así no van a salir con otra cosa. Okay, in your company, what do you have to do? Okay. I have a meeting at 9 a.m. Okay, and now I need that you ask the same question to somebody else. We are going to do the same chain drill. Vamos a hacer eh, como el mismo ejercicio del chain drill hasta que unamos a todos los eslabones, ¿sí? Choose somebody and ask the question. Elija a alguien y le hace la pregunta, por favor. Jenny eh, Suleima. Ok, ask the question. What are, go what are going to tomorrow? In your job. Um, I'm going to supervise the sales staff. Okay, okay, uh, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We are using have to, have to. Have to, okay. Yes. I have and to supervise the sales staff. I have to make projection. I have to assign goals. And I have to monitor the inventory and make reports. Okay, thank you. Ask the question, please. In your company, what do you have to do? Or in your office, whatever. You can switch the question. Um, Carlos Javier, in your company, how, uh, how do you? What do, you, what do you, what have, do you to, have to what, do? What do you have to do? And, and check formulas and whites and company. And, Nelson Gabarrete. Eh, ¿Cómo era la pregunta, teacher? You can switch it. Uh, la puede cambiar, por ejemplo, uh, usted le puede decir, in your company, do you have to wear a uniform? Lo que me interesa es que usemos el have to. But you can use that, that question, in your company. Do you have to use uniform? Podría ser una. Or do you have to dress formal? Ah, oh, okay. Okay, okay, teacher. And Nelson, uh, Claudio Mendes, sorry. Claudio Mendes, in your company, what are you going to do? Uh, I, I have to make sales reports. I have to check back accounts. I have to check my mail at all times. 
Eh, oh, okay. ok, ok. Lo que sí veo es que se me están confundiendo, me están mezclando el be plus going to con el have. Ok, ok. Entonces ya observé dónde está la falla. Ahora lo que vamos a hacer es lo siguiente. Let me see what we're going to do para que no haya falla. Ok, uh, you are going to create a chart like this in your notebook. Van a crear un cuadrito como este en su cuaderno. And you are going to put the name of the activity that you have to do in your company and something that you don't have to do in your company. Ok, I'm going to give you like three or four minutes. Hagamos el cuadrito, escribimos las, eh, las actividades. En este caso, for example, uh, let me see. Let me tell you this. If you are going to ask some question to some classmate, also we can use this chart. Si le vamos a hacer preguntas a algún compañero, también podemos hacer uso de este cuadro. Ponemos el nombre de la persona al inicio y luego escribimos qué es lo que él tiene que hacer y qué es lo que no tiene que hacer en su compañía, pero en este caso ahorita hagan un cuadrito referente a ustedes ¿qué es lo que ustedes tienen que hacer? aquí no van a escribir nada ¿qué es lo que tienen que hacer? ¿y qué es lo que no tienen que hacer en su compañía? para luego pasar a la otra fase ¿es eso claro? Yes, ok, thank you. Ok, para el día de hoy espero contar con la presencia de Cristian Ernesto Lazo Flores. At the end of the session, please. Espero ya tenga sus apuntes, sus dudas para poderle ayudar.
teacher. Tell me. How many activities are you going to write? Mm, at least four. Two that you have to and two that you don't have to do in your your problem. Okay. Do you finish? Yes. Una me falta. <laughs> Only one. Finish. Okay, 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 okay. And now I need that you create another charla, the one that I show you at the beginning. Ahora sí necesito que haga otro cuadrito parecido al que ya le mostré. Yeah, like this. Because you are going to interview uh, at least two different partners about the activities that they have to do and don't have to do at their workplace. And right here, you are going to write down the names here. In order to do this, uh, we are going to create a breakout room in trios, and you are going to ask questions to each other. For example, you can say in your word, do you have to answer the phone? Yeah. For example, do you have to write reports? You are going to ask the information in order to fill the chart. Okay, I'm going to start creating the breakout room. Les pido de favor a uh, que cuando se les asigne el breakout room, que se vayan inmediatamente para el lugar de que se les ha asignado, por favor. Es posible que en alguno van a quedar solo dos, quizá. Okay, I'm going to try to give you three minutes. Is that enough for you? Está bien tres minutos, sí. Yes. Let me try to do it. Five, please. Five minutes, please. No more. <laughs> Five minutes. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. no. Let me try to do it in a different way now. I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, three minutes, I'm going to give you three minutes. Let me try to do it now. Okay, here we go.
Remember that you are going to ask some question and get some information. Claudio, Claudio, Claudio. Claudio, are you there, Claudio? Claudio, can you hear me? Me quedé hablando solo. No, no, sí, no, sea, teacher. no nada. quedamos a la mitad. Teacher, con, no completamos. Con la, con la lengua enredada me quedé, teacher. <risa> okay, no, hold on, hold on. I'm going to give you more time. Please, one, one time, one more time. One minute. Here we go, here we go, okay. Okay, in this moment, all the participants are working, getting information from another classmate, and then they are going to chat with us, okay.
Teacher, yo sabía que el tiempo vuela, pero qué barbaridad, man. Yeah, you know, tengo un cronómetro en, en, en mi pantalla y ahí va contando el tiempo, you know. Esos han sido los minutos más cortos que han sentido en sus vidas. <laughs> oh, okay, now uh, we are going to share the information. Okay, how we are going to, to share this information? Okay, with the info that you have, con la información que ustedes tienen, what you are going to do is, lo que harán es que de esa información la van a convertir a pregunta y le van a hacer la pregunta a su compañero. And he is going to answer it. ¿Cómo? Por ejemplo, a uh, usted le pregunta, in your company, do you have to? Usted ya sabe qué es información en la que él tiene. Usted le puede preguntar algo que no sea realmente lo que él tiene para que él le dé la respuesta que usted está esperando. Por ejemplo, le dice, do you have to answer the phone? And he is going to say, no, I don't have to. Okay. Who wants to start doing this? Quien quiere iniciar? Mi teacher. Okay. Como ya usted tiene los nombres ahí, usted dirija hacia uno de los nombres que ya tiene y a esa persona le va a hacer la pregunta. Okay. Okay. Uh, Elizabeth, on your company, Tell do me. you have do you have uh, do you have to or No sé si, si la pregunta está bien hasta ahí, teacher, o le falta algo. Perdón. No, uh, me gustaría que la pregunta quedara completa. Por ejemplo, le dice usted, in your company, do you have to work uh, at night, por ejemplo? Si sí, ella ya le dio la respuesta y ella le dijo... Para, para que ella dé una respuesta corta. Yes. Ok, ok. Okay, Elizabeth, uh, yeah. in, your, in your company, do you, do you have to send information every day? Yes, I do. Uh, uh, Elizabeth, uh, in your company, do not have to serve food? No, I don't. Okay, revisemos la pregunta, por favor. Despacio. Uh, yes. Uh, yo lo hice. Do you? Es. You don't, 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 not, don't not. You don't not have to serve our food. No, I don't. Pero no es. Yeah. Don't, don't, dos veces escuché que dijo don't. Yeah, not necessary. In the, in the question form, uh, you don't need to include a negative part. Porque el que va a dar la respuesta negativa es el que va a responder. Entonces usted hace su pregunta normal. Oh, ok, ok, excelente. Do you, do you have to in your company server food? No, I don't. Ok. Uh, the other co 
con eh, era una persona que no estaba eh, dispuesta a teacher. Ah, okay. Okay. Continue, Elizabeth. Sí, solo, solo, solo Elizabeth. Está okay. manejando. Okay, ah, Elizabeth, continue. Teacher, I don't remember. <laughs> For that reason, you need to. Hello, in your company, do you have to revise free board and maintenance? Es que no, no me recuerdo. Ah, ah, okay. Make information. Yes, I don't. ¿Cómo, cómo es esa respuesta? Yes, I don't. Excuse me. <laughs> Tell me. Yes, I do. Or yes, yes or I do. No? Yes, I yes. have. Yes, I. I have. Do. Yes, I do. Oh no, I don't. Okay, sorry. Okay, go ahead. Somebody else, please. Bye. Other question or other person? I don't know if you have another person there. Hmm. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, please. Uh, me. Okay, Maria Elena. Anna, in your company have to check email? Yes, I do. And okay, 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 uh, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh yes, I do have check email daily teacher. Okay. Yes, answer. Okay. okay, cuando digo hold on, le digo espera, 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 espera. Ah, all right. Ok, la pregunta. Necesito que me diga la pregunta otra vez, María Elena. Have to check email in your company? Ok, ¿qué le falta a la pregunta? Teacher. Hello, sir. Yo tengo una pregunta similar, pero yo la planteé de esta forma. Dice, do you have, do you have to check email? Ah, ok, y el auxiliar, sí, para que se oiga mejor. Do you have... Yeah. It's correct. Yeah. Ok. Ok. That is right. Ok, María Elena, ahora corríjala y hágala de nuevo. Entonces sería, do you have to check yeah. email? Yeah, do, do you, you have company? to check email? Ah. Yeah. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. No necesitas tardarnos más. Yes, I do or no, I don't. Okay, next. Eh, va a preguntar a Oscar Anujo o le pregunto yo, Marilena. Oscar Anujo, eh, do you have to write report tomorrow? Yes, I do. Oh, yes, I have to write report tomorrow. All right. A question, a Maria Elena. A question Maria to Maria Elena. To Maria Elena. Maria Elena, in your company, you have, you, do you have to attend a meeting tomorrow? No, I don't. Okay. Next participate. Okay, to somebody else. Somebody else, please. Recuerden que se supone que entrevistaron a dos personas porque eran tríos. Okay, somebody else, please. Now, 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 now. I got you. 
Y apuremonos porque don Luisito tiene que ir a bailar. <risa> Tiene que ir a romper el hielo. Ok. Pero primero lo hacemos. Me, teacher. But, but first of all, we are going to do it with the question here in the class. Primero yeah. vamos a romper el hielo con las preguntas en la clase. And okay. then it's going to be at the party, ok? Ok. Eh, okay. Mister uh, José. Uh, ok. My info information. Email. Um, uh, repeat, please, uh, Omar. Mr. Jose, okay. do you have to check email? Yes, yes. Uh, yes, I, yes, I do. Uh, oh, yes. Uh, teacher, oh, yes. Este, yes, today. Uh, yes, today. Sí, sí, todos los días. Sí, todos los días. Yes. Yes, I check in today. Yes. Yeah, but the question you can answer is telling yes, I do. It's correct. Yeah, because it, uh, it's a yes, no question. Es una pregunta de sí o de no. Entonces le dice, do you have to check email? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Okay. Yeah. Yes, I do, Omar. Ahora, different if... Diferente sería si él dice, when do you have to check email in your company? And then you say, I check email in my company every day. Okay. Or I do it at morning, or I do it uh, before to leave from the company. Okay, somebody else, please, somebody else. Okay, yes. Miss Blanca Elizabeth, do you have to prepare the pyro? No, I don't. Okay. Maria? Alguien más falta? Please. Claudia, Claudia, teacher. Who? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Christian. Okay. I have a, Christ, a Christian, Christian, Christian. Uh, yes, tell me. Teachers, I'm sorry. I don't remember in this moment. I, you know, don't I, know, I, the I, I, I lost the idea. <laughs> you lost the idea. I'm sorry, teacher. Repeat, please, the question. Okay. Uh, is is what what do you have to do in your company? Is the question. See si. what do you uh, have to do? Sorry, sorry, Christian. Uh, sorry, Christian. Uh, es, es que nosotros lo hicimos al revés. Yo te, te yo te tengo que preguntar algo. Y tú solo me vas a decir, yes, I do, o no, I don't. De las la respuestas que tú me diste, ¿sí? Pero, ¿cómo es la pregunta, Cristian? Help me, please, ¿ok? O sea, usted tiene que hacer la pregunta, what do you have to do in your company? Y yo le voy a decir las respuestas que nosotros le dictamos. Ah, ok. Christian, what do you have to do tomorrow in your workplace? Okay. I have to clean the warehouse of construction equi equipment. And I have to receive to the new merchandise of gloves. Okay, thank you. And, and Claudio. What do you have to do tomorrow in your workplace? Uh, I have had to check uh, my email all time. Other 
other uh, I I don't have to eat in my desk. All right. Uh, Mr. Luis, uh, the question for you. Okay. What do you have to do in your company tomorrow? Okay, in my case, I, I have to do uh, make overtime reports. Uh, number two, I have to close in sales of the week. And number three, I had to meet with my boss. Only that teacher. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. That's it. That's it. That's it. Okay. Okay. Let me see what the time that we have. Okay, I'm going to send you uh, a link right now to the WhatsApp group and you are going to open it. Le voy a enviar un link en este momento al grupo de WhatsApp and you are going to uh, enter and solve a quiz. Is that clear? Yes. Okay, okay. Ahorita les envío el link. Van a entrar a una actividad corta que vamos a hacer relacionada siempre con los temas que hemos visto. In this case, going to be related to B plus going to. Okay, espero que nos ajuste el tiempo para hacerlo. Así es que listos, que ahí les va. I don't see your group here. I don't know. Let me see. What is it? Okay. Les cayó un anuncio de hello? Sí? Yes. Ah, okay. No, teacher. Ahorita, ahorita, here we go, here we go, here we go. Me avisan si no pueden entrar, por favor. Eso no lo vamos a proyectar, solamente lo van a resolver en sus dispositivos. A mí no me ha caído, teacher. A nadie le ha caído, a nadie, ahorita le va a caer. Okay, let us try to do it now, please, and tell me if you can open it or not. Just tell me if you can open it or not. Y me dejan la cámara encendida porque quiero verlo. I want to see your faces. Bueno, pues si entra a WhatsApp, creo que se apaga la cámara. Really? Al entrar a WhatsApp se apaga la cámara. Leo. Uh, pero ¿cuántos están con, con... No, porque, eh, bueno, no sé cuántos están por teléfono. Haciendo... Bueno, yo estoy con teléfono. Ok, los que no están por teléfono creo que... Se va, se va a desplegar. No sé si hasta el momento se ha apagado la cámara, pero yo sí estoy trabajando en un teléfono también. No, está encendida. Igual yo, Teacher, estoy trabajando en un teléfono. ¿Se puede poner el nombre? Ahí aparece, ahí aparece el espacio. Teacher no deja poner el nombre. ¿Really? Uh -huh, no da la opción poner el nombre, uh -huh. Teacher. No puede escribir. No podemos escribir ahí, Teacher. Let me see what happened there. Okay, hold on a second, please. Uh, 
What's going on here? Eh, otra cosa, otra cosa, eh, solo es la página número dos la que vamos a contestar, ¿verdad? Yes. Ok, excelente. A mí no me cayó nada, teacher. Es el grupo. Es un enlace, Nelson. No puedo colocar el nombre. Ok, hold on, hold on, hold on. ¿Ah? No les permite colocar el nombre. No, no, no Okay, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. The, the most important thing is that at the end. Pero si permite contestar, teacher. Sí, sí, sí. Lo que más me interesa es que al final vean el puntaje que tuvieron, porque esta nota no va a ir para ningún cuadro. Lo que sí quiero es el ejercicio. En ah, cierto, okay. en ah, cierto okay. modo, quizás es mejor que no le no puedan escribir el nombre para que si no estén afligidos de que, de que es una nota que le va a aparecer en su resultado. Sí. Okay, todo para que practiquemos. Tisha. Excelente, esa es la idea. Así que mejor dejémoslo así, que no se pueda escribir el nombre, pero sí su puntaje lo van a poder ver. Ok. Ok, be careful about the, the answer that you are selecting. Uh, todo lo hemos visto, todo. Ten, ten of the ten. What are you really? Doing? Yes. Ok, lo que pueden hacer es hacer una captura y enviarla al grupo cuando ya tengan su resultado. Y ahí le ponen su nombre. Solo para ir viendo el avance, no, no es porque esa, eso va a ser una nota. Está facilito, es easy, easy. Let me see, let me see. Yes, you got it. Y mejor que no les aparezca para poner el nombre, porque si no se me da fin. <ríe> Ahora traten de hacerlo, todavía tenemos un poco de tiempo, ¿no? Así que ten, tómense su tiempo. Silencio total. Remember this, that it's a review that we are doing now. Es un repaso el que estamos haciendo el, de uno de los temas que vimos. No se los puse así mezclado para que no se confunda.
¿Será que ya no vamos a ir a la fiesta? I finished, teacher. Ah, ok. Send me the result. A screenshot. And put your name on it. Let's go to the party in this moment, teacher. <laughs> no, todavía no me ha caído su resultado. Not yet, sir. I'm still waiting for your result. Teacher, teacher, yo lo Ay. hice, yo lo hice en el WhatsApp de mi computadora. Abajo solo dice enviar. Ahí le doy enviar nada más. Send. I, I don't know if you make an uh... Necesito que haga el, el... Sí, le va a dar enviar. Pero necesito el screenshot de donde está el resultado. Híjole, ¿dónde está el resultado, teacher? Sorry. Donde dice total de puntos, a la par donde dice Ferenc de Squish Model 4. I don't see you, teacher. I don't see... ¿Vale? Cuando ya, cuando ya le ha dado enviar, entonces le va a dar el resultado. Mientras no lo envía, no le da el resultado. Ah, ok. Vamos a ver. Go, teacher. Déjeme sí. Perpulsación. Elizabeth, ajá. Wow, teacher. Siete de diez más aquí. <ríe> Sorry, teacher. <ríe> Ahí puede checar a uh, which one are wrong and which one are right. Are we? Don't tell, don't say, it, don't say, it, don't say. It. Porque algunos no han terminado todavía. No, no les diga, no les diga. Cuando dice enviar, le damos, teacher. Yes. Veamos a Oscar. De dos. Veamos a Oscar cuando tiene seven. Ok. Vamos a ver. Grisel. Congratulations. Bien. Otra siguiente. Enviar. Ok, ¿quién más? Claudio, el MC, Claudio. Ah, ok, check up, check up. Ahí pueden hacer su feedback para ver cuáles son las que no están bien y por qué. Okay. Two minutes left. Nos quedan dos minutos. Asegurarme que la persona a quien le corresponde la asesoría eh, se va a quedar ahí. Por favor. I'll be there, teacher. Ah, ok, 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 Cristian. Ajá. Uh -huh. I got your point, I got your point here.
Juan Carlos, let me see Juan Carlos. I got it. Next time I'm going to set time for the test. En la próxima le voy a poner tiempo para que el solo se cierre. <laughs> y así se apuren. Time is over, time is over, time is over, time is over. Me faltan varios. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, only nine, the half. Me falta la mitad, la mitad. Treinta segundos. Tori Tecon, Tori Tecon. Ok, en lo que paso lista, terminando de pasar la lista y se va a cerrar. Ok, Ana Beatriz. Present. Eh, Blanca. Elizabeth. Present, teacher. Carlos Alfredo. Carlos Antonio. Present. Cristian. Present teacher. Claudio. Present teacher. Edwin. Elmer. Uh, let me see. Ember is not here. Ember. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Elizabeth. Gonzalo. No, here, Gonzalo. Okay, Luis Alfonso is there. Luis Manuel. Luis Manuel. No, está. María Elena. María Elena. I'm here. Nelson. Eh, solo, teacher, en mi computadora no pude hacer un screenshot, pero tomé una foto. Ya la voy a mandar. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Uh, Omar. Francisco. Present, present teacher. Oscar Anulfo. Present. Walter. Present teacher. Jenny. Present. Uh, Carlos Javier. Present teacher. Judith no apareció, ¿verdad? Ok, José Eduardo. Present teacher. Juan Carlos. Carla Marisol. Right here, teacher. Ok, Carla Marisol. No está Carla Marisol. Ok, time is over, time is over. Time A mí no over. me mencionó. Really? Sí. Sorry, let me check up again. Será que ya me estoy durmiendo y que no lo mencioné. Let me see where you are. Let me see where you are. 
After Claudio Grisel. Okay, I got it. Okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, do you finish? All of you finish? Ya todos terminaron, sí. Teacher, ya las corregí, me saqué 10 otra vez. No, 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 no. Yes, teacher. No, no, no. Teacher. Hello? Sí, me saqué. Okay. Uh, there you can see the, the right answers. Ahí pueden ver cuáles son las que le salieron mal, ¿ok? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Ok. Another thing that maybe I'm going to do is that uh, maybe based on the topic that we have started, I, I can send you uh, a quiz, but you are going to answer it in your free time, if you want. Basado en el tema que vayamos viendo, también les puedo ir enviando un quiz, que, pero ustedes lo van a responder en su tiempo libre. Solo para que vayan midiendo cuánto es lo que van aprendiendo, ¿no? I got it. Ok. Ok, thank you, T-shirt. Ahí solo, solo van a tener que abrir una página. A... Ahí le puedo explicar en el grupo cómo van a hacer. Ok, ok. Y solo van a ubicar un código y van a entrar y ahí se lo hacen y ahí está automáticamente la nota también. Okay. Una pregunta pues... rápida, teacher. Ok, chame. Eh, ahora estoy trabajando en la plataforma. Lo siento, no se puede decir inglés para no tardar. <ríe> y me preguntaba si en la parte donde dice discos en algunas partes es necesario llenarla o no. Talking about the discussion. Yes. Mm, no, I, I guess that in, at this moment I haven't seen, uh, haven't said any question about it. But it's going to be for the, maybe for the next Monday I'm going to do it. Okay. Okay, I don't know if you, somebody have any other question. Miren, ahora les he dosificado bastante el review que hicimos porque hemos hablado bastante eh, algunas explicaciones en español para que me entiendan, ¿no? Entonces espero de que los resultados en esa plataforma sean bastante aceptables, que sus notas sean bastante buenas, excelentes, ¿sí? But the reason that I speak only English because it is because that in order that you get familiar with with the language. Okay, thank you very much. I hope to see you next Monday. Have a good night. Be careful if you are going to celebrate tomorrow. Como dice, don, como dice yeah. don Luis Alfonso. ¿Cómo es que dice? ¿Cuál es el dicho suyo, don Luis? Go to the party, okay? No, no, no. <laughs> Tiene otro dicho. Tiene otro dicho. <laughs> Sorry, I don't, don't remember. Has to do with drink. Tiene que ver con drink. Uh, don't drink too much. <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, go, okay. Go, go, go to the church. Go to the church. Okay. Ah, okay. Instead of the bar. <laughs> Very good. Uh, okay. Good night, everybody. Happy weekend. Okay, I hope to see you next Monday. Bye-bye. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay. Uh, el día de mañana voy a actualizar notas. Espero las hayan terminado. Se me había olvidado decirles. Okay, teacher. Good night, teacher. Okay, good night. Solo estoy teacher, esperando. hasta cuándo vamos a hacer, teacher. Thank you. Good night. Hello. Hasta bye. qué número vamos a hacer, teacher. Ahí aparece que sería hasta las 5, que sería la de hoy. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, teacher. Sí. Good okay, night. Bye. bye bye. See you later. See you later. See you later. Ah, Ember apareció. Ember. Giovanni Polio Morales. Okay, let me see if I check it. Veamos a ver si lo chequeamos.
Yes, it is. Yeah, yes, I don't know if driving or something. Uh, ember, 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 ember. I'm going to. Okay. Okay, Christian and Ernesto Lasso Flores. Okay, teacher. Tell, tell me if you have a question and okay. I can help you with that. Okay, eh, mi única duda, bueno, en español sería, mi única duda que tengo okay. es acerca de él, bueno, es about to how much, when uh -huh. to use how much, and, and when to use how many. many. Okay. Exactly, eh, because, because, eh, 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 bueno, no encuentro diferenciar, eh, bueno, no encuentro cómo detectar cuándo diferenciar, cuándo okay. usar. Sí, ya le comprendo. Ok. Ahorita mismo le muestro algo. Ahorita, ahorita, ahorita mismo le muestro algo. Do you remember when we talk about cannibals and uncannibal nouns? ¿Se recuerda cuando hablamos de nombres contables y no contables? Sí, más o menos. Ok. ¿Se recuerda que vimos este cuadrito? Exactly. Sí. Yes. Ok. Right here in this uh, chart, we have how much and we have how many. Vamos a usar how much con todos aquellos nombres que sean no contables. Es decir, con todos aquellos nombres que... Eh, no podamos hacer los eh, plurales y vamos a usar how many con todos los nombres por ejemplo uh, if you are going to ask the price or something you are going to say how much is it usted va a decir cuánto cuesta eso ¿por qué? porque sabemos que el dinero es no contable alguien me puede decir no pero sí pero si yo lo puedo contar sí pero no podemos contar todo el dinero del mundo ¿Me comprende? Ok, ok. En cambio, el how many es de cosas que sí podemos contar. Por ejemplo, la pregunta que aparece ahí dice, how many features does it have? ¿Cuántas características tiene eso? Uh, how many colors is this in? ¿Cuántos colores hay ahí? How many functions does it have? ¿Cuántas funciones tiene? How many products do you want? ¿Cuántos productos quiere? ¿Sí? Entonces, si usted observa a este lado, la mayoría de nombres tienen plurales. Por ejemplo, colors, functions, products. Okay, point that. Y en cambio a este lado, no, mire. Dice cost, warranty, store. ¿Se recuerda que hicimos? Ah, yo les presenté eh, una lista de nombres contables y no contables. Hicimos sí. un ejercicio, ¿se recuerda? Sí, me recuerdo más o menos, sí, sí. Ah, ok. Entonces, sí, sí. en ese ejercicio aparecían a algunos nombres que eran eh, contables, por lo tanto, eso se usa con how many. Y los que no son contables, los que les poníamos una U, son los que usamos con how much. Ok, veamos si me comprendió. Si yo quiero preguntarle a alguien cuántos hermanos tiene, ¿cuál de las dos voy a usar? How many. And how many brothers do you have? Ok. Pero si alguien uh, necesita azúcar para el café, ¿cuál sería la pregunta? Eh, how much. How much sugar do you want on it? ¿Sí? How much sugar? ¿Cuánto azúcar le vamos a poner? Y después lo que se cuenta son las unidades. Por ejemplo, dice two spoon, three spoon. Si son cucharadas, usted le dice dos cucharadas, tres cucharadas. Esa es la forma de cómo usar how much and how many. No sé si le queda eh, claro. Creo que una de las claves con la cual he podido comprender es esta parte donde usted dice de que Lleva S al final. Sí, va en otras, pala sí, en otras okay. palabras. 
los contables son aquellos que puedo tener los singular y los puedo hacer plurales. En cambio, los no contables no los puedo hacer plurales. Por ejemplo, los líquidos. Water. Agua no puedo decir aguas. You ¿No? Know? Eh, rice, sugar, different names. En cambio, los otros sí, yo los puedo hacer plurales. Entonces, esos sí son contables. En el caso de, estaba viendo la oración número 6. De estos ah. ejercicios, donde dice complete the following question using how much or how many. El 6. Okay. Sí, sí, sí. Para mí, para sí. mí, el correcto, viendo eh, la estructura de la oración, bueno, sería how many. ¿Es correcto o no? Yes, it is. ¿Por qué es correcto? Porque el nombre que tenemos aquí son galones. Galones, correcto. Y, y eso aquí, sí es contable, ¿verdad? Ahí estamos cuantificando los galones de agua. Entonces, por lo tanto, va a decir how many gallons of water does this need? ¿Cuántos galones de agua necesita esto? ¿Sí? Lo mismo sucede en el número 4. Dice hours. ¿Miren? Uh -huh. How many hours do I share it? ¿Cuántas horas lo cargo? But what about number five? Es, eh, how much? How much, how much money, money do you have? Uh, yeah. Ok, creo que sí, ya, ya, ya. Sí. Excelente, esa era la duda eh, que tenía, que no la podía comprender muy bien, pero con esos eh, plus que me he dado, pues creo que hoy sí ya comprendí. Ah, ok, excelente. Uh, ¿Ya no tiene otra pregunta? No, 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 de los temas creo que este era el que tenía más duda. Ah, de okay. lo demás con la práctica estoy afinando un poco, pero este era el okay. que me tenía como detener. Ah, ok, excelente. ¿No? Okay. okay. Thank you Thank very you much teacher. for being, being here with me. Okay. I hope to see you next Monday. Okay. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.